Today, we're diving deep into the intricacies of time lapses within DaVinci Resolve. After encountering some challenges with importing time lapses previously, I felt it would be beneficial to create a straightforward tutorial addressing this. Let's dive right in. Begin by navigating to the media page in DaVinci Resolve. Within this page, you'll come across a folder that contains a singular time lapse. Remember, each folder should contain only one time lapse to streamline the process. Upon opening the folder, you'll observe a series of individual images. However, the objective is to convert these images into a unified time lapse file. To achieve this, head to the frame display mode options. Here, select the sequence mode. This action will combine the individual images into a cohesive time lapse file. Once the sequence mode is activated, you'll see the images transform into a single file. While immediate playback might not be seamless due to system constraints, the time lapse file is now ready for use within DaVinci Resolve. Adjust its scale as necessary, and you're good to go. To summarize, this tutorial provides a clear path for importing a time lapse into DaVinci Resolve, highlighting potential challenges to watch out for. If you found this guide helpful, consider subscribing for more content. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.